squad, hope you're all keeping well and welcome to today's 36 minute push, pull and legs muscle build, tone and sculpt session that you can perform absolutely anywhere with very limited equipment. All you need to complete this session is either a pair of dumbbells, even one dumbbell, a kettlebell or a barbell, body pump bar, whatever you have access to to push forward with this session. It is going to be focused on push, pull and lower body so that means we're going to be targeting chest, shoulders and triceps then moving in to your pulling movement which is back and biceps and then lower body. So the concept of this workout once again it is the 40 seconds of work and 20 seconds of rest so we're trying to push that 8 to 15 rep range if you're using that heavier enough weight. If you are only using lighter weights push past the 15 rep range bring the intensity and go all out with good form with this session. So we're going to perform uh, three different exercises and then we're going to repeat the circuit. So for example, it's going to be like an Arnold press, then into a row, then into lower body movement, then we repeat that again. So it's a circuit uh, style push pull legs workout, then we move on to our next set. So it'll be three rounds in total, each round consisting of six exercises and a circuit based setup, but I'm going to be following alongside with you in real time. So if you need a warm up, Go for it now, well, let's get ready and let's push forward with today's session. Okay team, moving in to the first exercise. You can do it standing, you can do it kneeling, or you can do it on a bench if you have access to it. But it's gonna be our Arnold press, shoulder press. Hold the dumbbells inwards and turn them out like that and repeating. Then after that, we're going in to bent over, overhand rows. So with the dumbbell or the kettlebell, overhand grip, okay, then we're up in the high sumo squat, so that's our first three exercises, we're going to go one after another, then repeat and then move on to our next set of exercises, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, 10 second countdown begins now, let's go for it, okay. so three, two, one, let's go. Good reps, good quality form. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Good work. Okay. Overhand rows next. So we're trying to focus on good form here, push out the reps and lift that heavier if we can. Or if you're using lighter weights, really focus on the squeeze, the contraction, with each movement. Okay, let's go. Overhand rows. Five, four, 
three, two, one. Okay, back into Arnold press, then we're doing our rows, then our squats again, then we're moving on to our next set of power exercises. Three, two, one. Standing, kneeling, whatever you want to do. Let's go, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Okay, staggered hand push up. So what that is, one hand out in front of the other, push up, then alternate, like that. Okay, you can go under your knees if you need to. Staggered hand, so one hand out in front of the other. Two, one. Push up. And switch the position. Let's go 10 seconds. 
three, two, one. Good. Right, we're doing reverse lunges next to the lower body and the hamstring. push-ups, then our close rows, then our reverse launches, and that's round one complete. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, reverse lunges to finish off round one. Brilliant work. Fantastic round to kick off this session. chest press, okay you can lie down on the floor, do a floor chest press, you can do it on the bench. Then the next one is going to be two deadlifts, okay, then up, two upright rows, so it's a combo, two deadlifts, two upright rows, and then the next exercise is going to be our high front lunge, hold the dumbbells up, I'm doing your front lunges like that, then we're going to move on, repeat twice and then move into the next exercise combos, okay, 10 seconds countdown, Go for it. Lower press or bench press is the first one. Right, let's go. Oh, 
Grab it out. If you're using lighter weights, bring the intensity. If you're using heavier weights, focus on that good rep range, 8 to 15, and progressive overload. Two deadlifts, two upright rows is the next one. All right, one, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Shout the reps. Good form. Focus on good quality reps. Two. Okay, next one is front lunges. Hold the dumbbells to your side, or you can hold them up, hold them in a high position. Three, two, one. Front lunges. Oh, these full body workouts. Let's go, 15 seconds. Go on, five, four, three, two, one. Right, back in the chest press. We repeat these three again before we move on now to the next combo. Three, two, one. A few more reps, let's go. Okay, back up, two deadlifts, two upright rows. Let's just keep the momentum, keep pushing. Three, two, one, let's go. Three, two, one. Woo. Okay, back into these front lunges. Feeling this right now. Right, front lunges is next. Let's go.
it. Easy work. Come on. Long leg over in till our next combo. Okay. So it's a front and a side raise. So you're going front with one arm, side with the other at the same time. And then you're alternating. Okay. So it's an alternating raise. So front with one arm, side with the other. Then we switch. Okay. Like that. Extension and then up again, working that V taper up the back. Let's go. Lift the hips up off the ground. Okay, staying on the ground, we're doing our hip thrust. Just rev it out, hip thrust.
PC work. Brilliant, hip thrust is next. Finish off round number two. And then we have one more round. What a set. Okay, on three, two, one. Let's go. Brilliant work Warriors, round number two complete. Grab a drink and we're into our third and final round with our next set of exercises. This is it squad, the third and final round of our push, pull and legs workout. Now the first exercise is gonna be a push back push up. You can even perform these on the dumbbells if you want, but we're coming down, push up and pushing back off. And again, you can go on your knees, push up and back off like so. Then we're up into our rear delt flies, standing, and then side launches, and then we're gonna repeat that twice, and then move into our final combo. Okay, so this is it. Big push now for this last round. Let's set the timer here. Okay, and we're going in 10 seconds. So get ready, let's push it out. Everything you got now for this final round. Three, two, one. Let's go, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, okay. Up in the rear delts. Okay, rear delt flies. Let's go. Three, two, one. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Lovely. Okay, side launches again. Love this exercise. So overlooked in people's strange routine to target your inner thighs. So side launch each side. Let's go. Stretch. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Back into these push by push ups. Okay, 
okay? On the three, two, one, let's go. Next, what a workout, starting to feel the fatigue here now. Three, 
two, one. Easy. Go on, three, two, one. Lovely. Okay, time to repeat the finish. Three minutes remaining. Chest flies, arm and hand rows, and leg raise. Let's finish it off. Three, two, one. Brilliant. Okay, back up, under hand rows. Big session this one today, 36 minutes. No excuses. Right, let's go. Let's go, 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, squad. Massive fist pump, massive well done for completing that. Push, pull, legs, sculptor of a session. I absolutely love these workouts, love working out with you. I'm pushing forward each and every single session. I would really appreciate it if you leave a comment below. Let me know how you got on with the session. If you enjoyed this style of workout, this length of workout, sessions in a small space like this here, please make sure because I really want your feedback on everything so I can keep on taking this studio to the absolute next level. I have big goals now moving in to next year, so I really want to keep the momentum and push forward within the studio and within the squad and within this incredible community. Keep tagging me in your stories, keep telling your mates about these workouts. There's so many people out there stuck at the minute, don't know what to do, too afraid to go to the gym, too afraid to even get started working out, don't know how to perform exercises, just so many negative thoughts. So hopefully get them into the studio and they can work out at their own time, in their own space, push forward with their health and fitness goals. Most importantly, keep the mental health good, physical health good, and keep on pushing forward together. As always, thanks again for working out alongside with me, and I'll see you on the next session.